My name is Donald Bohr. I'm the Registrar of Innes College, one of the seven colleges in the Faculty of Arts and Science, and you're watching Fast Answers. There are four pieces of university identification that a Faculty of Arts and Science student requires. A U of T student member, a UTOR ID, a T card, and a University of Toronto email account. When you apply to the University of Toronto, you were given a University of Toronto application number. That number is converted to your permanent U of T student number. You use it to sign into the student web service. Your UTOR ID is the code that you used in order to browse the Join U of T portal. It includes some or all of your last name, perhaps part of the letters of your first name, and perhaps a random number. Once you're an active student in the Faculty of Arts and Science, you'll use your UTOR ID to access course-related uh, web pages and various other web tools. The other two pieces of identification, the T-Card and the University of Toronto email account. Every student has to have a T-Card and a UT mail account, and you need the first in order to get the second. The T-Card is a photo ID smart card. It's your library card, it gets you access to the activity centers such as Hart House and the Athletic Center, um, as well as to the student services such as Health and Wellness, the Career Center, the Housing Center. It contains a computer chip that holds money so that you can use it for printing and photocopying on campus and for loading flex dollars to pay for food almost anywhere on campus. You can even use the T-Card for discounts on the TTC and Go Transit. Most importantly, you'll use the T-Card when you write exams, and, as I've mentioned, when you set up your UTOR mail account. Now, you get your T-Card in person at Robarts Library during their hours of operation, which are listed in the description section below. You need to bring your print or email offer of admission, as well as a government-issued piece of identification uh, with your photo on it that would include a driver's license, a health card, a passport. Um, at Robarts, they'll take your picture, create your T-Card and also give you a personalized sheet of paper that has something on it called a secret activation key. You don't want to lose this. Then you'll sign up for your UT Mail Plus account. This is the university's official way of contacting you and it's the only email address that the Faculty of Arts and Science will use to contact students. You activate your UT Mail Plus online using the secret activation key that you got on that piece of paper at Robarts. Um, and, uh, from there, you get a pretty impressive email account that has uh, 50 gigs of uh, memory for inbox and file storage. To summarize, four pieces of identification. University of Toronto student number, UTOR ID, T-Card, and your UT Mail Plus account. Thanks for watching, and remember to tweet at us with your questions and subscribe to this channel to get notices of new episodes.